Welcome to Love and Life's Journey. I'm Chantel. It's time for the May Dollar Tree Haul. Let's go on in and check out what's new. The first thing that caught my eye were these really cute spring and summer welcome signs. And they also had these farmhouse style farmers market and garden signs. Be sure to keep watching because I will be telling you how to enter the Dollar Tree Mystery Box giveaway a little later in the video. I often find it hard to find just greenery at Dollar Tree, but this time they had quite a bit. And they have a lot of new, fun, colorful ribbon. I don't think I have seen any of these tie-dyed ribbons before. I keep seeing new designs in the cross stitch kits. These would be so great for a beginner because they're small, they contain everything you need, and they wouldn't take a long time to complete. And I was really excited to see this in the Crafter Square aisle. This is glass etching cream. I can't wait to give this a try. This caught my eye because I've done a lot with kids at church and this is a really large Welcome to VBS banner and it's Noah's Ark. It's really cute and it's a nice big size for just a dollar. These cat and dog signs are new. I have not seen these at Dollar Tree before. And look how cute these little wooden rainbow signs are. One of them says sweet dreams, another one says little one. These would be so cute in a nursery. So I often see these little bottles at Dollar Tree and I love them. I think they are so cute and cool, but let me know in the comments what you would do with these besides like storing little beads and stuff. I'm looking for some different ideas, but I'm not sure what to do with them. I'm also loving these vintage style stickers that they have been carrying. I just think these are really beautiful. If you are new to my channel and you like DIY projects, then be sure to subscribe because I have something very exciting coming up in the month of May. I have been chosen as a contestant in Heidi Sambel's Creative Champion Contest, and I will be competing with these eight other ladies, and it is going to be a blast. The first round starts May 8th, and it will be every Saturday through the month of May. I will put the link to Heidi's channel in the description box below. Make sure you're subscribed so you will see those videos and be able to vote for your favorite projects. These tall clear glass mugs were really big and they're very heavy. But if those are too big and heavy, they do have a smaller size. I think these would be great to use that glass etching cream on. This Dollar Tree did have a few different styles and sizes of storage baskets. And they have some new pretty gift bags that are great for spring and summer. These are a really nice quality bag. They have glitter in the designs on one side of the bag and they're just a great buy for a dollar. I never get gift bags anywhere else besides Dollar Tree. So here are some of the things I picked up in my Dollar Tree haul. I got some of these nice little organizing bins. These come in a two pack and a three pack for the smaller ones. And these are great to use in drawers and for all kinds of miscellaneous things. I grabbed some of these rub-on transfers. I like these designs. Um, they're really great to use for farmhouse projects. And I got a couple bags of the reindeer moss. I like the texture of this moss and it's a little bit hard to find sometimes. So I was happy to see this. And now that we're going into summer, Dollar Tree's carrying some barbecue supplies like these bamboo skewers. These are like 32 inches long and they are great for crafting.
I also grabbed several different styles of burlap ribbon. and several other styles of ribbon that are perfect for farmhouse DIYs. These little wooden drawers or bins with the metal embellishment on the front are new. I haven't seen them before and I thought these would be great for a project so I picked up four of these. I did find a couple of new designs in the wooden truck signs. I think these are really fun for spring and summer. They did pick up some of those farmhouse garden signs. These are really cute just the way they are, but they're also a really great size to use in other DIY projects as well. These hanging garden signs are fun and they are some great shapes that you could use in other DIYs too. The last of the signs that I picked up were these garden stakes and these are not meant to be used outside but they would be really fun additions to a project um, for a, a garden theme. I saw these little farmhouse pictures a long time ago on someone else's Dollar Tree haul, but I have never seen them in my store, and they finally had them, and I just think they are really cute, and I love all of the designs. I saw these vacuum storage bags at Dollar Tree. I've never tried them, so I decided to pick one up and see how it works. Let me know if you have used these and how you like them. So every month I give away a Dollar Tree mystery box filled with items that are hard to find from Dollar Tree. To enter, all you need to do is comment below with those items that you are looking for or that you would like to see in a mystery box. That doesn't necessarily mean that's what will be in the mystery box, but that will help give me some ideas of what you guys are all looking for. So be sure to subscribe if you haven't and hit that notification bell so that you'll be notified when I upload new videos and do the announcement for the winner. And also be watching for those creative champion contest videos coming starting May 8th every Saturday through the month of May. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you all have a blessed day.